Hello and welcome to this video today. You can download this PDF on our homepage. See the description box for further information. Today we're gonna talk about the base rule and how to apply and decode it. The problem we're gonna solve is quite often cited in the field of medicine, psychology and economics. In the end, the problem says, what is the probability that she actually has breast cancer? If you now want to apply the Bayes rule, the formula for the right solution would look like this. Where you have here the prevalence, the hit rate, the complement of the prevalence and the false positive rate. You might be able to put in now the right given values from the task, but if you're watching this video right now, I assume that you struggle to apply the base rule. But now I'm gonna show you how you can easily solve this problem. Now, quite often the base rule based tasks are given in conditional probabilities, but now reconsider and think in terms of natural frequencies. I choose for this chance, 1000 people. Well, if you don't know what the decision tree is, now you can see a decision tree. So, look, we look first on the left part. The prevalence, BC stands for breast cancer, the prevalence is 1%. So, out of 1000 people, 10 people have breast cancer. And out of these 10 people, 8 people have a positive test result. Now look on the right side. 990 people have no breast cancer. While 95 people out of 990 still receive a positive test result. So if you reconsider the letters given in Formula 1, it's gonna be easy. So we divide the true positive cases, like 8 people, by all positive cases. And as you can see, it's 8 divided by 8 plus 95, and this is equal to 7.8%. So, quite easy, right? So, reconsider in, in natural frequencies. If you still struggle, here comes help again. Think about a matrix where you can also put in easily the given values. And all the information about that you can read here. And for your practice, try to solve what is the probability that she has not the disease, in this case breast cancer. I hope you I hope I could help you and good luck with it.